Would you care to come out here and have a conversation with me, sir? Sir, sir. Please come here. Okay. You're not you're not interested in the pokey? Hello everybody, welcome back to Mist Survival. I've not touched this game in almost a year. It might have even been a little bit more than a year. There's been a lot of changes to it. Three years ago, a mysterious thing happened. A mysterious mist covered many parts of the world. People got sick and died. Many of those who survived suffered changes. They became ferocious, turning vicious when touched by the fog, seeking flesh meat, uh, flesh meat to feed upon like other humans. You are one of the very few who are immune. You escaped and survived. Okay, they, get, they added uh, gas masks. Uh, the heat gauge, wetness, more complex statuses will be added in the future. Okay, if you're wet, you move slower. I beg to differ, but all right. Uh, bow and arrow, gun customizations. Oh, we can modify weapons. Okay, gotcha. Upgrade fish bucket. My bucket has been upgraded. I have one slot in my fish bucket. <laughs> I have a fish bucket, guys. I have a steak. Now, there are zombies slash some kind of creature. I'm not sure exactly what happened there, but uh, those are a thing in the game as well. Plus, there are wild animals. Okay, okay. Can I open the door? Yes. We have got Flickering outside. A machete, some cement. Ah, food. Ah, there are a couple of items that I am looking for to start with. Like, uh, backpacks are always good because you start out with a limited amount of backpack space. So the sooner you can find backpacks, the better. Uh, secondly, obviously we need some weapons because there are indeed bad guys. So that's a thing that we need to keep an eye out for. Um, what, are you a hard stick? Yes. That is hard wood. I need a knife. I have to find a knife first. Okay. Can I pick up the plants and take them home with me? Bad guys? Bad guys? Yes, no? Alrighty. Uh, a gear, some scrap. I can't pick up the scrap. Is there anything I'm carrying that I don't actually need to carry right now? Um, there. Let's put my hatchet in here. That right there. Uh, just in case. Scrap goes into a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Paper. Gloves. I can put some gloves on. Paper. There we go. Woo! We there we go. I have got that on. Sure. Inventory. Nice. Now then, I could actually make a spear. Oh, I could shelter here. I don't know, guys. We could probably shelter here. There's not a whole lot of containers in here, but. It's not far from start. And there are a few items. I don't know. I, I, I really don't know if I want to stay here or not. But then again, I also don't know what kind of map we're looking at. Whether or not we're going to get a whole lot of other opportunities to find places. Holy flickering lake, Batman. Okay, there's a full-on town over there, though. Okay, we'll claim this spot. There's probably a couple of containers I can pull into that area. And I'm not sure whether or not these uh, zombies slash whatever they are can uh, climb things. So... Okay, now I have an active base. Let me drop things off into... I really wish those were, you know, actual containers, but they're not. But this up here is a container. I want to go over here and investigate this town. See if we can't find some stuff and things. What are we looking at? 
Uh, this town right here gives me Far Cry feels. Like Far Cry 5. Oh, there's another building over there. Okay, those are probably good ones to hit too, but let's see if we can't find some food to start out with. Outhouse. Ooh, we got a wheel right there. That might be useful. Can't open the outhouse? Apparently not. I think I heard... Ooh, I think I heard a zombie. Oh, we got a couple of drinks. Yeah, I definitely heard a zombie. Oh, there's three in there. Okay. Are you stuck behind the door? You know what? I probably shouldn't be picking a fight with you so early. Let me not do that. Sir? Okay, I could definitely use lashings. That's for sure, too. Are there any containers over here that I could pick up and walk around with me? Bad guys? Bad guys? Oh, wait. These assets look way different than the previous ones. The hell is it? A lure. Okay. Uh, we've got ammo. We've got food. I need backpacks. Uh, as a matter of fact, hang on. Uh, take that out of my inventory. How's my hunger doing? Uh, go ahead and eat that. Whoa. Uh, lots of gloves. Winter gloves. Yeah. Okay. I don't know whether or not those things are going to stay there or not. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. The mist. Oh, no. Oh, no. I am so not ready for the mist. Are they coming? Oh yeah, that's definitely the mist. Okay. So I guess I'm going to be stuck here for a little while because once the mist rolls in, those zombies roam free. I'm not seeing any zombies. That doesn't mean they're not out there. I'm just not seeing them. Oh, nope. I see them. I see them. Okay. So where are we? Where do we think we're at whilst I'm in here? Uh, housing estate looks like it's a work in progress, work in progress, work in progress, so if we stick over here, we should be fine. Old West Town hunting area, community, um, heck, we might be right here, because there's the church outside of town, there's the main walkway, I think this might have been where I spawned, or this might be where I spawned, I'm not really sure. Is it done? Yes. Okay. Ooh. Okay, in order for me to get a sleeping bag so my character can rest better, I need to come back and get that. But, uh, let's continue to check through this house. Um, okay, uh, like I said, I'm just going to take everything out. Drop it on the floor. I have no idea if this stuff is going to stay there, but I'm not going to come back for it anytime soon, so... Might as well. Uh, that's an antibiotic. What am I carrying on me? What is this? Painkillers. You know what? I'm going to say the antibiotic is probably more important than the cleaner right this second. Well, we are actually set up pretty well. We've got a base over here and a town right next to it to pillage. I'm going to say that's a pretty good thing. That first house, I mean, before we even got that far into it, had a whole bunch of stuff. Where, where do I see time? Okay, 12 o'clock. We've got plenty of time to make another run over there. I would like to get the stuff to make a bed roll. I'm pretty sure that I would, if I was to die, I would spawn back at my base. But this is the kind of game that when you die, you have a chance to loot things out of your inventory. And if you lack patience, it's better just to go to a previous save anyway. Speaking of previous save... Save. 
uh, just keep saving your game frequently because there's also the thing of things can drop through the planet, you can drop through the planet, um, the game could freeze up and you could die because of a bad guy, or, you know, any number of reasons. It is still a game in development, so keep that in mind. Saved often. And I would definitely recommend going back to a previous save rather than allowing all of your stuff and things to get lost. Let's see what's in here. Bye, guys. Hi. Would you care to come out here and have a conversation with me, sir? 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 Please come here. Okay. You're not, you're not interested in the pokey? C come on, guys. Come on, I know you want to come out here. Knock, knock. Oi. Come on. Hello. Hi. Come on. No, 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 come back here. And there's like five dudes in there. What you guys hiding? Is there like really good loot in there? He has all of the potatoes. Alright. Ah, ow. Nope. Apparently he did not appreciate me killing his friend. And taking his potatoes. Alright. On the stamina. Ooh. Military upgrade. Alright. Nice. Uh, inventory, go ahead and eat that. I'm just going to stand way out here in front of these guys and eat this. Oh, look at that. You can see the peaches, dude. Like, nice and dusty. It's like me whenever the sun comes out. Okay, gotcha twice. Gotcha twice. Huh? Nice. Got some salt. Nice. Thank you for all of the random stuff that was inside your pocket. Yep, I am full of stuff and things again. Is there a box in here that I can use? Or before? Yeah, I've seen this room before. It was in a horror game. Ooh, SWAT helmet. Uh, inventory. Let me drop... Let me drop the candy bar for a second. I'll take that right there. And equipment. Add that in. Yeah, covering all of the important bits right here. This is exactly how that works. No containers. There's still lots of stuff in here, though. Lots of stuff. High-quality metal scraps. Those are probably important. Okay, but no container. Okay, this general store looks like it's probably one of the unfinished. I might be in an unfinished town. In which case, that tells me at least where I'm probably at. Take that. At least a full stack of these. Okay, still not seeing a container, though. Okay, I would say we've got a pretty big haul. What do we need to work on first? Um... My ability to sleep through the night has a lot to do with my bed, so getting a bed would be a good idea so I can rest properly. Food and water is probably a good thing, so if I'm not mistaken, in this game you set out the blueprints, find what you need, and bring it back. So we probably need to do that. Uh, what about that? It's a little bit closer to home, and I am hunting backpacks and containers, so maybe over here is a good idea? Nothing, nothing. Ooh. Hang on. Wait, I, I'm gonna get better fishing stuff. <laughs> oh boy! Uh, yeah, sure. Upgrade all of my fishing things. Okay. Uh, there's some wood. Actually, probably not a bad idea to grab that. Especially if it's like campfire wood. Hey, a cooking pot. I'll take that home with me. Yeah, hell yeah. And I could take that with me, too? Okay. Ah, stuff and things. Can I carry that? No. That would be too easy. The doctor at home. 
Ooh. Colt. Thank you. Oh, it's a watchtower. Um, watchtowers. There we go. Now, whenever I go raiding the town again, I can take this container with me, and I've got additional spots. Okay, and not those containers. Okie dokie. I think I've got enough time to run out and do one more trip into the town. Though I don't see me getting a chance to fully fill up, but I think it'd be a good idea to go ahead and do the race towards town and attempt to crash through at least a couple of the kitchens, because I'm going to need the food. Knock knock! Okay, none of those were for this. Ooh, alcohol. Um, aside from the obvious, it is also a thing for making bandages. Well, whenever I get a shotgun, I'm going to be uh, a whole lot better off, that's for sure. Okay, this house is clear. Not that I found what I was looking for, but it is clear. Uh, do you have any containers? You could possibly have a lot more loot too. Though I still haven't pulled all of- oh there's green stuff coming out of that one. I still haven't pulled all of the loot out of town, so... A chain. Hmm. A suppressor? What? Uh, um, just just leave that on him because I can't carry it right now, and I don't even have enough ammo to worry about suppressing anything anyway. Okay, I'm gonna have to come back. I'm gonna have to come back. Obviously, I can't carry all of the stuff and things in one trip as much as I would like to. Uh, whilst we are waiting on that, let's see, in the build menu, what can we do? Basic fire, campfire, torch, barrel fire. Okay, I've got all the sticks, I mean all the stones I can get. Um, we would probably need more sticks or branches or something. Tree base foundation, tree base A, tree base A, four doorways, B, watchtower, sky path. Skywalk tent. Hmm. Okay, that's a whole lot of stuff I need to actually build, but I'm not going to have a chance to build before it hits nightfall. Uh, we need sticks and components for all of that. There we go. Okay, it's not pretty, but if I can get like a a, a, a door right here or something like that, at least I'll be able to put my tanning and whatever else out here instead of inside. Why do you keep coming over? Alright, ladies and gentlemen, that is it for this episode. I will see you in the next Mist Survival. You have a wonderful day, a wonderful night, and you stay shiny.